We received this question. I've been working at recovery for just over a year. When I started, I had almost every symptom you mentioned and never thought I could ever get rid of them since I had them for years. But thanks to your information and working with one of your therapists, almost all of my symptoms have subsided except for one, which is getting worse. I know you mentioned that dizziness can get worse for some people as they near complete recovery, but my question is, why does that happen? Why does dizziness seem to get worse toward the end of recovery? Well, first, congratulations on your hard work and determination to succeed. It's great you've worked so hard and are seeing good results. That's great. Yes, it's true. Some people notice their dizziness worsen toward the end of recovery when other symptoms have lessened or subsided. I experienced that too during my recovery. While it's not known exactly why that happens, I have a few theories. Number one, a reduction in circulating stress hormones can create fatigue. Stress hormones increase alertness and energy. Faithfully practicing your recovery strategies will reduce the amount of stress hormones circulating throughout the body. This reduction can reduce energy and make a person feel fatigued. Fatigue is a common cause of feeling lightheaded, dizzy, or unsteady because of the drop in energy. Many people feel lightheaded, dizzy, or unsteady when fatigued. Dizziness can persist as long as the body is fatigued and until the body is sufficiently rested and normal energy returns. Number two. A reduction in circulating stress hormones can unmask pain and discomfort. Stress hormones mask pain and discomfort so that if we are injured during fighting or fleeing, we can continue to protect ourselves until the danger has passed. A reduction in circulating stress hormones can unmask how the body truly feels, revealing symptoms that might have previously been masked, such as feeling lightheaded, dizzy, or unsteady. And number three, stress dramatically affects equilibrium. Stress, especially chronic stress, which we call hyperstimulation, can dramatically affect the body's equilibrium, how the body manages itself in space. As the degree of hyperstimulation increases, the effects on equilibrium can be substantial. However, as you work at recovery and as energy and alertness diminish due to the reduction in circulating stress hormones, the true effects on equilibrium can magnify, making dizziness seem much stronger. Many people notice their dizziness increase during the final stages of recovery. Now, any one or combination of the above factors can cause lightheadedness, dizziness, and unsteadiness to feel stronger toward the end of recovery. Now, the good news is, if you stay the course and continue faithfully practicing your recovery strategies, including containing anxious behavior, your body will complete the recovery process and all anxiety symptoms will subside, including a return of or uptick in feeling lightheaded, dizzy or unsteady. As the body completes recovery, you should see your dizziness completely subside. However, don't be surprised if you notice your dizziness subside but return occasionally as your body stabilizes. It's common to have hours, even days of being dizziness-free, only for brief episodes of feeling dizzy to pop up from time to time. This is also common during the final stages of recovery. No matter when brief episodes of dizziness occur, don't react to them fret about them, or worry that they might get stronger. Your job is to continue to passively accept them, reduce your stress, and let more time pass. Again, as your body recovers, even these episodes of dizziness will subside in time.